Ah, all right, guys, look at this, look at this. So this is a cannon or a big gun with the recoil effect. So yes, guys, I did something here, a little mechanics that will turn this into a cool, flex-worthy cannon. All right, and yes, I will uncheck anchor first to show you what I am talking about. All right, so I put uh, four buttons. So these are the controls for firing this uh, big gun or cannons and the chair well the chair uh, is what I use to control the rotation of the turret all right just added laser for targeting because guys uh, I actually turned off the aim so this mechanics works best we in this video guys I will teach you the mechanics on this all right with the recoil effect but not the gun itself because guys uh, the gun itself is very very easy easy to do three two one fire boom yes look at that guys have you seen that guys you see the barrel uh, has been pulled back when it fires and the fiery effect so one more fire see that <laughs> see that guys Really cool effect, right? One more. Boom. And yes, fire. All right, all right. Well, of course, guys, I will teach you that, how to do that. It's a full tutorial. So for now, I will show you what are those things, all right? So these are four thrusters equals with this. And yes, a piston and some delays all right so these delays are very very important guys by the way this is how they are connected it's not that so complicated guys at first look it looks complicated but actually it's not so let's try again boom there you go so i'll let's uh fire with this of you boom all right one more yes and here bam so let us start now so uh, we will just going to create a a basic or mock up of a cannon or a big gun all right so i will start with the wheel well guys if you are going to create this better if you put some wheel so that you can you know control it for targeting especially when cannons aim are off all right so yes we are creating a cannon all right so as i've said we are just going to make this uh, very basic all right what important here is guys i will teach you the uh, mechanics all right so there you go in here so yes this is the gun and this one all right so this will serve as the barrel so a big square barrel <laughs> minecraft style all right so for this one uh i just want to make just a little separation yes your point one will do and by the way uh it's the minimum uh, required separation for uh, these two so that you can control them separately otherwise uh, it this if you if you have less than 0 0.1 well they will still be considered as attached all right so I'll just put this uh, this one is just for you know just want to add some little details all right there you go so for this uh, yeah, by the way, let's put some color on our uh, gun. All right, that will do, I think. And the next step is, all right, uh, I'll just, w I just want to place one block here. All right. All right, where is it? The build, there you go. And then we are going to put this piston, all right. And then change it properties. Uh, change this into 10 so this is the fastest the piston can do and perhaps a uh, piston length at 3 yep that will do or maybe we can uh, make it 4 so if you make it 4 uh, the barrel will be pulled greater up to here maybe so I think that would be a great uh, a great recoil effect so yeah let's make it 5 there you go all right and then all right so gotta put one more blocks here there you go and then switch to 0 0.5 so because guys i just want to make sure and you must make sure also that this is properly attached to the piston because guys sometimes uh, pistons are having problems with pistons that you know you thought this is attached already but no it's actually not so uh, yeah sometimes it happens all right so it is now connected really really good so now we can 
pattern, this transparent, and also this one. There you go, all right. And then, um, so in my gun or in my cannon, I put four sets of cannon, right? So for this one to make it fast, I will just uh, put two sets of cannon. Uh, anyway, it's just uh, the steps on adding the cannon, the on adding cannon sets are just the same, okay? So I will now put cannon, so one, all right. Then I will just clone this. There you go. So, you know, cloning is, is faster. All right. There you go. And yes, this is gonna be the second set. And yes, second set, I will just turn this into red. All right, there you go. And I will just place one switch here so that they will be automatically binded here because uh, we want to have a separate control with that, all right? And yes, we are going to use buttons so that this will be a mobile friendly build, all right? So yes, by the way, yes, I will place some buttons here. So this is just for testing, all right? By the way, uh, anyway, you can place the buttons anywhere you want, all right? And perhaps I will place chair here oh, maybe the chair will be there all right let's, uh, let's just create some you know some kind of a little command center here <laughs> all right there you go and maybe some rotation like this all right so at least we got some little command here all right there you go really nice I like that wooden uh, t design it's really nice. All right, there you go. It is cool. We need to turn this black. All right, awesome. So I just want to disconnect this. All right, and then we are going to place the buttons now. All right, maybe we can just turn match rotation. There you go. There you go. So I just want to turn the other one, maybe green. There you go. So let's turn this into green. All right, so that you know where you are going to match it. And yes, of course, we must disconnect this with this. So the chair, uh, I just I just want to make a separate binding with this, but uh, actually it's not a problem in uh, any, anywhere you want, guys. It's up to you what binding tool you want, you want for the wheel, all right? Then, of course, we are going to place some set of delays. Where are the delays? It's here. And then I'll just... Uh, maybe I'll just place the delays here. There you go. So, yes, the delays are not connected. All right. So, settings for the delay. So, guys, uh, select these two. All right. So, these two... Uh, delays all right and then change it to zero so the max uh, the minimum delay time is 0 0.05 and that will do and for this one maybe delay time is a uh, 0.5 i think that will do all right and then uh, we have to connect all right so we have to connect this delay by the way i'll delete this now so that now it's not confusing as you can see they are not connected to any buttons or chairs, right? So the next thing is we are going to connect this. All right. And also this one. All right. And then this. And then this into this. All right. And then we're going to connect it here also. And here. So as you can see, guys, all of these are connected to the piston. So this is the piston. And then... Uh, this uh, set these two sets of uh, delay is connected with this each other all right so as you can see you can you can clearly see where are they connected okay and then what's next what's next all right so we are going for the cannon so connect these cannons with this all right and this one these four cannons 
with this okay so now we are going to connect the button to this delay all right and this green one is for this so by the way yeah let's change it, their colors okay there you go so that is where they should be connected all right there you go and then uh we can now actually merge this all right let's just move them here all right so merging merging you know what having trouble tool is much will make your life easier guys so if you don't have trouble trouble tool well you must grind for this huh? <laughs> this is really really helpful guys so i will turn off transparency and the aim all right so the aim should be off so it's much more effective if you turn off the aim all right so i'll just move it inside this all right there you go and of course guys i want to add some thrusters there you go so i will just uncheck match rotation and then rotate like this all right well of course uh the thrusters the fire should be getting out from here all right so it should be the direction of the fire should be like this okay same direction where the barrels are pointed or pointing there you go so they are both connected here they should not all right so the, yeah let's just fin fix their connection so connect the red one here and connect the green one here all right and then we can now turn them transparent and the collision yeah we can actually turn off their collision all right merge them first and then merge it here so make sure yes make sure it doesn't touch this all right the piston part there you go just want to fix this all right so with the wheel torque should be at green and yes we I just want to make this slower wheel speed three like that and then I think yes uh, this one this is important guys turn off the collision that's very very important and laser well yeah I think we can add some laser now all right so just uh, turn off the transparency of that and then let's just add some uh, neon blocks there you go so this is for the laser guys and there you go so we can target the enemies or the opponents easily all right and then uh, let's reduce its transparency by 50 percent and turn off collision and of course we're going to save then i will uncheck anchor there you go oh yeah i uh, forgot turn off transparency with this one all right so can i control this now yes i can control but no up and down wheels it's okay it's, it's okay all right let's see let's see red one fire all right did you see that guys the recoil work guys so here is the slow motion for you guys all right yes so yes guys as you can see it it creates some fire all right the the barrel moves backward or being pulled back so one more there you go boom all right boom nice effect right one more boom all right there you go look at that bang all right really cool right so oh i forgot to turn this off there you go fire Fire! All right, guys. So, guys, yes, this is something you can place with your tanks, ships, right, jeeps, trucks, and well, of course, something you can flex to your friend. You know, <laughs> having a great effects like that, a mechanics like that. And yes, guys, this, again, this is mobile friendly because we're using buttons. All right, look at that. Boom! <laughs> and here it is, guys. Shoot some tree. All right. Here's the tree. Fire! Ooh! Ooh! Fire! Alright, and one more! 
<laughs> Alright guys, so this is it for this video. By the way, if you are not yet subscribed, please subscribe now and click the notification bell and please like and share the video. So guys, thank you for watching. Bye-bye!